we will see an algorithm to insert a new node at the beginning of single linked list. First, we will see when the linked list is not empty. So in this case, we can see an example with two nodes. First node is having the value A and the second node is having the value B. First node is connected to the second node and the next value of the second node is null. And begin pointer points to the first node. We write the logic inside a method which is named as insert bg which takes a parameter that is a value that we need to insert. We create a node which is named as stem. Now every node of single linked list will consist of two part data part and next. Inside the data part we need to store the value which is our parameter x. So we write stem data equals x. So the value of x will go to the data part of 10. Next we need to make the connections. Now the newly created temp node should get connected to the first existing first node. So we write temp next equals begin. So temp next will points to the existing first node which is begin. Now the temp should become the first node so that uh, begin will points to temp. So we make begin to point to temp so that temp will become the first node. Now in the main method we can call insert bg method with set of values. So every time we call an insert bg method a new value will get added at the beginning of single link list. Now the same logic will work even if the link list is empty initially. So when the linked list is empty, begin will point to null. So first we create a TMP node, a node which is named as TMP, which is having data and next part. In the data part, we store the value X and in the next, we store the value of begin. Currently the value of begin is null. So null will go to the next part of TMP and we make the begin to point to temp. So begin will come to the first node, which is a newly created node. Execute and see whether you are able to insert a new node at the beginning of single linked list. To insert a node at the beginning of single linked list, first we have to create a free node named 10 and store the element to be inserted into the data part of the 10. So first we create a node which is named as 10 and store the data what we have to insert into the data part of the 10. Next, store the value of begin. Now the begin will be having either the address of first node when LL is not empty or null when LL is empty to the next part of the new node. So second step, the value of begin should store into the next part of new node. In third step, assign the address of new node to the list pointer begin. 